Hello guys, welcome back. This is C-Signal. I'm going through this information technology, uh, 2023 June past paper one. What I'll do for this and guys, make sure you guys do drop a like on the video before I even start and subscribe if you haven't. If you are new, please feel free to share the video with your friends and encourage them to subscribe as well. And if any ads um, pops up on the video while you guys are watching, please ensure that you watch the ads guys. Um, if it's non skippable please, I'm asking you guys to watch the ads. That is the way of showing support back to me as I help you guys as well. All right, without do further, so I'm going to jump into the question. So number one, which of the following are, are considered computer hardware? All right, and computer hardware has to do with output devices. All right, guys. Number two, it says the use of program store on a flash drive. The program must be transferred into... And it has to transfer into a RAM, which is random access memory. All right. Number three, it says which of the which of the following devices is most likely to be used with a point of sale? And the point of sale has to do with touch screen, uh, barcode reader. So the answer for for number three is A. All right. Number four, it says which of the following would not be considered Cloud storage, all right, and a cloud storage would has nothing to do with uh data stored accessibility on LAN, all right, on a local area network. Perhaps, all right. All right, number five. It says which of the following is best reason for using cloud storage instead of local storage? So, um, for a cloud storage, it provides greater security than a local storage, perhaps, all right. Number six is which of the following functions carried out the box in Z. So right here, um, we have input, perhaps. We have input. So as you guys could see, the arrow going down uh, for Z. Uh, this is a, this is this this unit right here uh, would basically be the storage unit. All right. So all of the information going through. So we have input right here, and we have output. And then we have we have the processing, we have the processing right here, and then right at it Z be the it would be basically the storage perhaps, right? So Z is the storage. Number seven it says which of the following devices used to input data into a computer? And it has to do with most, right? Number eight, it says in which of the following types of interferences is the user required to remember a specific instruction of syntax? All right. Uh, let me see for this one. It has to do with the command driven. All right. Number nine. It says the printer most suitable for creating the models of globe above is. And hint on the globe above has to do with a 3D printer. All right. Number 10, it says which of the following protocols is used to ensure that web browsers and servers communicate with each other. And it has to do with um, HTTP. It has nothing to do with void. Right? Number 11, this one is very pretty easy. It says the symbol represent right here. And guys, everyone do use this. All right? It's the Wi-Fi. Number 12, it says authorized real-time interception of private communication on a computer network is referred as, and it refers as electronic evade strapping, all right? Number 13, it says the double inch data verification involves, and it has to do with the same data enter once, then re-enter by another person, all right? So the answer number 12 is D. Number 14, it says web developer is important to a company because this person, because this the person perhaps is and the person is responsible for the company's website. It says a web developer, all right? Number 15, it says which of the following sequence shows the increase in computer memory capacity. And it has to do with megabytes first, guys, which is the least. Uh, then we have gigabytes, which is GB. That we have terabyte, all right? So the answer for number 15 is E. All right, number 16, it says in the URL, http slash www.shoes.com. The shoes.com represent and it represent the domain name, all right? Number 17, it says we shall follow statement 
about the biometric system is false, right? And it has to do with, let me see this one. User amount of memory stored, no. And it has to do with C. The personal data capture is very intrusive, right? Intrusive. All right, number 18. So we should follow types of technology is commonly used by bank to read on a check. It has, to not, it has nothing to do with OMR, it's optical mark reader. It has nothing to do with the POS. The POS system is a, is a system that you touch, like touch screen, guys. It has nothing to do with OCR, would be the MICR. Eh? Number 19, it says transferring data from remote, from a remote computer to a personal computer refers to, refers to as downloading, right? Eh? Number 20, it says the data has been processed that has meaning uh, is termed and is termed as information. Number twenty-one. It says tell the community can be, tell you tell you community um can be best described as and it can best describe as working from home by connecting homes and office. Sorry. Number twenty-two. It says uh, the process of scrambling messages at and sending and unscrambling them at receive end is called and it's an encryption. Right. So that is the process of by and like for example, guys, the scram, um, scrambling codes, and and then you're unscrambling um that would call encryption. So that are like private, perhaps, um secret messages uh that are unscrambled, um that are some very um high security factor, right? Number twenty three. So we should follow is not a hardware component of a of a computer system, uh, and it has nothing to do with data file. Right. Number 24, which of the following can be term application software? It has to do with Google. Uh, sorry. It has to do with Google. Right here. D has to do with Google Chrome. Mm -hmm. Alright, number 25. It says which of the following function is performed by modem? And a modem um it modulates analog and digital signals. So it's B for number 25. Number 26, it says which of the following uh provides this proof that the extensive use of ITC has posit positive impacts on the field of business. And for this one, it has e-commerce, e e um, electronic points of sales, telecommunity, and it has to do with all of them. Okay. Number 27, it says which of the following device can be used for both input and output? And it would be touch screen. Okay. Number 29, almost there, guys, we're getting there to the half of the paper. Which of the following? Is true of accessing files sequentially, and it has to do with uh, let me see. Basically, it has to do with start with the first record, right? Without do further said, guys, while you guys are watching the video, please make sure you guys are um subscribing to the channel and drop a like. All right, guys, drop a like on the video. All right. Number twenty nine. It says a system that analyzes data and uses rules, previous information to deliver possible possible decision is called and it's called the expert system. All right. Number thirty. It says an official of an official of a company excels confidential information about his company to a company Y. What is the term used for the type of information misused? And for number 30, it has to do with um, industrial um, Epsom H, eh? S1H. So it has to do with um, industrial S1H, guys. Number 31, it's a wish of the following are not categorized as a system software. And for number 31, it has nothing to do with productivity tools. All right, number 32. So which of the following system about the misused information, misused, sorry, the misuse of computer system is false. And it has to do with accessing a computer security that illicit, that illustrates first on purpose um, that a system um, software piracy perhaps. All right. Number 33, it says before purchasing a computer, James um, given a sheet with the hardware specification. So these are the specification and it says the CPU speed of the computer is and it has to do with 3.6 GHz. Right? Number 34 it says the part of a private uh, internet using private network using internet technology and public te telecommunication can be accessed by a business supplier, vendors, customer and partners. 
call and for this one guys um we always have a little controversy between this one between intranet and extranet i would choose extranet um why um intranet is uh basically a private network and it sets up the part of a private all right intranet is also a part of a private perhaps but it says for vendors and customers and partners so i would choose extranet if any inquiries guys please feel free to leave it in the comment section all right number 25 so which of the following types of network must be a user uh, accessing in order to surf the internet and a from an ad spot on a beach and it would have to be double and all right <clears throat> sorry number 36 it says which of the following is an example of a correctly formatted email and the answer is a luna at api.net all right Number 37, so we have to follow editing. Editing features apply to the shaded cells in the form, and it has to do with splits. All right. Number 38, it says, what is the function of the small square label X? Is it, um, let me see. It has nothing to do with selecting cells in range. It's deleting cells, no. Oh, John, look at it, guys. And it has copying content of the other cell and it's copying content of the other cells guys all right number 39 we're almost here guys uh the, the, the following formula is located in b6 on the spreadsheet so we have b3 plus b4 plus dollar b b plus five it says in the formula copied uh the position located immediately on the left what is the resulting formula all right so for number 39 would go from a3 so it'd be a3 plus a4 all right so that's would be c guys so number 39 we're 40 almost here guys it says the manager want to find the names of the suppliers who receive their products orders right which fields would be used in the inquiry all right let me see on this one supplier supplier and receive all right uh, it's basically it would be from feel supplier supplier and receive all right so the answer would be a for number 40 guys all right number 41 it says two fields can be slick as a part of calculation all right and it has to do with date order and amount o all right number 45 42 perhaps sorry You're almost here guys it says a primary key most um most unlikely identify a record in a table so we have to follow it qualify as a primary key and a qualify as a primary key has to do with a single field uh let me see yes a single field perhaps yes the answer would be a single field single field only eh? <clears throat> sorry number 43 it says if the data if the data in cell e e4 is changed what would be most likely to effect, um, affect the cell and for 43 uh it has to do with what let me see it says data in e4 all right so e4 right here we have e <coughs> sorry right here e4 um if you change it let me see it's most likely to do what g4 g4 perhaps all right <coughs> sorry number 44 it says in order to create a spreadsheet chart uh which compares the average for each test the range which would be used are so for number 44 guys i would go with c for this one it would be from c2 f2 and c6 to f6 eh? number 45 it says the criteria that must be used in a database query is to select all appliances manufactured by samsung that cost more than 3000 is and for number 45 it would be manufacturer samsung price and the amount eh? Number 46. So we should follow in sequence of steps deleting a record in a database table is correctly. And it has to do with, let me see on this one. It has to do with open a table in a design view. Uh, two, it says selecting the row of the del uh, deleted and right click. And it has to do with uh, choose, choose the delete row options. And then we have choose yes and then select and delete. All right, we confirm a delete. So the answer for number 46 is B. Number 47, so we shall the following activities as to take place for a user to follow a hyperlink to an email address and send an email. And for number 47, it has to do with uh, D, all of them. 
me one in, 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 install email software is loaded and then we have the user will write the email and then we have the user will send the email all right we're 48 so we should be following contents control will be useful uh, when creating a fileable electronic form for online use and for number 48 it has to do with let me see with this one I will go with B guys all right it would be um the the, the date picker perhaps on the drop list, all right? What's the number 48? It's B, perhaps, all right? Number 49, it says, uh, it is necessary to include the column's titles, row labels when creating a column chart to ensure that the, and we have to ensure uh, that basically the correct heading are displayed, all right? Let me know how much you get, guys, let me know. Please free to leave it in the comment section. I could get back to you. Alright, number fifty. So we should have following feature would give you the old and new version of a previous save documents using a word processor, and it has to do with save as a new file name. Alright, number fifty one. We almost here, guys. Uh, we have right here. Read a b if a then a print a. So it says the the informing algorithms. Um, the computer read two numbers. The print. And for number 51, it would be um, the first number if it's smaller than the second number, all right? Number 52, it's a the following constructs will execute the sequence of statement until specification uh, is false. So for number 52, it has to do with a uh, while do, all right? Number 53, it says when implementing a program, which of the following steps come after executing? And it has to do with maintaining. I'm trying to get through this answer real fast, guys. Number 54. So which of the following um, programs language are not considered as high level? And for number 54, it has nothing to do with assembly. All right. Number, all right. Number 55. Let me zoom a little bit more. Uh, it says, perhaps, which of, the, uh, which of the steps would be first? And for number 55, it has to do with learn you have to learn there's no way you can pass the xd first or write the xd you have to learn or get served ticket you have to learn first so, so the first one would be learn cxc um, um subject content right and after you learn um after you learn you'll basically write and after you write uh you will pass and after you pass you get served ticket right? follow the sequence it said number 56 what does the symbol um square i ship right here uh I represent in the information technology so this shape right here guys um it's most likely to be um a decision all right yes uh yes this is the shape is like a diamond shape perhaps it's a decision all right all right number 57 says a computer program is coding algorithms which calculates the class average for given exams it creates a variable class um average right which data sh type should the specific when declared in the variables and for number 57 it has to do with real so we need a real variable all right number 58 almost here guys in writing algorithms so implement while loops terminated value 999 we should be following conditions conditional statement would be written for number 58 it has to do with let me see while number while number 999 do for number 59 it says what components of a of a problem typically use the term prints to carry out instruction for number 59 we have to do output all right for last and final guys let's go we're 60 we have write enter um read the price then we have that um price 15 percent right that so it says uh which line contain processing statement and uh, let me see three processing right here it's the VAT right here, VAT price. So the answer will be 3C. All right. I want to say, guys, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys do drop a like and subscribe to the channel without do further said. Um, any ads popped up on the video, guys, please feel, please feel free to watch the ads, perhaps. And let me know in the comment section, guys, how much you have received out of the information technology 2023 June past paper one. Without do further said, guys, thank you guys for making it with CSEC now.